Hey everybody, today we're going to be installing a Rev1 ECU tuner to this Polaris Ranger XP1000. First thing we're going to do is locate our diagnostic port in our fuse panel. It's going to be underneath this front seat here on the passenger side. We're going to lift it up. There's going to be a cover right here. We're going to remove that as well. So we have our diagnostic port and our fuse panel here. We're going to go ahead and pinch the two ears on our fuse panel and remove the cover. We're going to flip it over and we're going to look for the EPS relay. Okay, so we're going to look at our fuse panel. See, we have all of our spare fuses over here, fan relay. Okay, so here's our EPS relay. We're going to go ahead and remove it. We're just going to set this aside and we're going to come down here to the diagnostic port. Push down on this tab. Pull it loose. Now we're going to grab our Rev1. ECU tuner out of the box as well as the harness for the tuner and our USB flash drive. This USB flash drive is going to be what's holding our tune. But we're going to take our harness, make sure that you have it oriented properly, plug it in the bottom of the ECU tuner, Just sit your tuner up here on the dash, and we're going to go down here to the recently removed diagnostic port we're just going to plug it right in make sure it snaps good then we're going to follow the instructions on the screen we need to calibrate it and touch the screen then touch each of the dots all right and it says detect vehicle so we're going to go ahead and click on that and we're going to go through and we're going to read these and you'll just want to click next make sure you read all of these pages It says turn on ignition and press OK. So here's one click. The ignition's on. The dash is illuminated, so we're gonna go ahead and click OK. Success, unit license to this ATV. So we're gonna hit the back arrow. Now this is where we're gonna grab our USB that was provided in the kit. We're gonna plug it in to the side of the Rev1 ECU tuner here. And right here on this little gray box on the top right, we're going to click copy files. So it looks like we have our stage one and our stock tune. We're going to go ahead and click on the stage one. We're going to copy it to an empty slot. So we have all these empty slots. We're just going to do the first one there. We're going to copy it to the slot. And then it's going to open the file. It's going to do some things here. It'll take it just a moment. All right, so 100%, the copy is complete. We're gonna hit the back arrow, go back in the copy files again. Now this STK, that's gonna be our stock tune, so if you ever want to revert to stock, you're gonna to wanna to add this to your ECU tuner. Same process here, we're gonna click on copy to tuner, go to an empty slot, copy to slot, and we're gonna go through the same process, we're gonna let it load up. It's copied to the ECU, we're just gonna hit the back arrow again. Then we're going to go up here to the top left and click on Tune ECU. We have our STK, or Stock Tune, and then we have our S1R. That's going to be our Stage 1. We're going to tune the ECM. Check ignition is on and press OK. Our ignition's on, so we're going to click OK. And we're just going to let it load up. So now it looks like the ECU tuner's tuned the machine. Flashing is complete 100%. We're going to go ahead and hit the yellow arrow to go back. What we're going to do is now go to the key, shut the key off. Once the key's shut off, you're good to go to remove the ECU tuner from the diagnostic plug. We're going to go ahead and pull it out. We can go ahead and plug it back in the holder. Make sure it snaps in. Then we're going to grab our EPS relay. Go ahead and reinstall it. We'll take our fuse panel cover, go ahead and pop that back on as well. And we're going to go ahead and reinstall this piece as well. Flip the seat down. And we're going to fire this thing up. Seems like it's running good. Now the last thing to do is take this thing out for a test drive. And that's how super easy it is to install Super ATV's Rev1 ECU tuner on this Polaris Ranger XP1000. 
For more information on our Rev1 ECU tuner or any of Super ATV's great products, give us a call at 855-743-3427 or check us out online at superatv.com. Thanks for watching and have a great day.